Hi. Today's project is removing water spots from this 2023 Mustang Mach-E. So take a look at this thing. This thing is less than a year old and we've got pretty severe water spots on the paint. And actually it's everywhere. And these are the kind of water spots they don't just wash right off, you know, use a cleaner on a towel. Still got these spots that are really bad, and they are everywhere. See how bad that is? And that just really detracts from the shine and from the longevity of the paint because these will burrow their way into the paint. And since this car doesn't have a ceramic coating, that damage can be permanent. See on these plastics up here. So we'll be removing these off of here today. Now, the most common cause for this is simple. It's user error when they wash their car. It's so easy to just go out with a hose and hose off your car in the summer because it rinses all the dust off and gets it relatively clean from just uh, airborne things flying around and landing like dust and pollen but those water spots come from that practice right there. And that's because the minerals that are in the water, all groundwater, whether it's city water or well water, the water evaporates off your car, but those minerals are left behind. Those minerals are caustic, which means the instant that water droplet dries, they attach themselves to the clear coat and start causing this kind of damage. Now, if you have a ceramic coating, it will protect against that. You could still get water spots on a ceramic coating, but they won't etch their way in and they're not permanent. So the easiest way to avoid this is to always dry off your car when you're done washing it. Don't just hose it off and walk away. Okay, I'm done with this project. Take a look at the water spots now. So got them all removed from the paint and the glass. So they're all gone. The car's looking fantastic. However, you should consider a ceramic coating because look at this damage in the paint right there. See that spot? That's permanent. That's where tree sap had landed on the paint. And because it's black and it's hot and there's no protection, it left this permanent little warble in the paint. Not the end of the world, but over time you can imagine that's gonna start etching, gonna start flaking, gonna look bad. And the more and more of those you get on here, the worse it'll look. So just something to consider. So just remember when you're done washing your car, dry it off and never, ever, ever just hose it off and walk away or you will be paying a detailer to take the spots back off. Also, watch those lawn sprinklers. Summertime, we got lawn sprinklers that are parked up next to the car and spray on it and then it evaporates off and you get water spots. We can always tell if it's from a lawn sprinkler because usually it's just half the car has water spots. So if you've got spots in your car, but only in one section, like just the hood, just the one side, just the other side, probably lawn sprinklers. So you may want to address that too. Okay.